to another craft time. My name is Ms. Nicole and I'm a youth services librarian with the Grundy Library. Today we have a really fun Earth Day themed project and activity for you today. I'm really excited to share it with you. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, it's going to take a little bit of time but not too long. Um, so we are going to go right over to look at the supplies you're going to need and then I'll walk you through how to complete the craft. All right, let's get started. All right, today you're going to need some clear contact paper, a pair of scissors, a white crayon or color pencil, some green and blue tissue paper, and a piece of black construction paper. And then you're also going to need something to trace a circle. So I'm using this bowl that I found at home. I'm going to use it and my crayon to trace a circle onto the black construction paper. My bowl is just a little too big, so I'm just redrawing in the lines. And then I'm going to take my pair of scissors and cut this out. So this is just going to be our main circle for our earth. We are then going to draw another circle on the inside, and that is going to be where we create our border for our sun catcher. So here I am free drawing this. I do recommend you trace something else. I couldn't find anything, uh, so my circle is going to be a little lopsided. Uh, so then I'm going to take my scissors, like I mentioned, we're going to cut this inner circle out so we're left with a black border, and this is going to be the border of our sun catcher. Then we're going to take our circle and we are going to trace it on our clear contact paper and then cut it out. So we are using our clear contact paper as our sun catcher where we're going to be placing our tissue paper on the sticky side so that we can see that translucent of the tissue paper when we hang it in a window. So here I am cutting out the clear contact paper. I'm going to be peeling it and then you're just going to want to peel it all the way but with leaving some of it still on the paper so that we are not going to um, get it stuck to anything else than what we need it to be stuck for. And then here you can see I just pulled off the rest of it once I've matched it. Then we're going to take our green tissue paper and our blue tissue paper. We're going to cut them into strips and then into squares. This is what we're going to use to create our earth land and our blue water or our oceans. So we are going to cut those into squares and then you're just going to put them onto the sticky side of the clear contact paper. I'm going to do some groupings of green as our land masses and then fill the rest in with blue to create our oceans. And this is just a fun way for your little ones to practice. It should take them a little bit longer than it did me here, but once that's complete, it's time to add clear contact paper onto the other side to make sure that the tissue paper stays stuck and all complete for when we hang it up. So here I am again, just peeling out my clear contact paper. Then I'm gonna put the tissue paper side down onto the sticky side this time, and then I'm gonna cut the excess off. And then our sun catcher, earth sun catcher is now complete and you can hang it in the window and see the light shine through. Great job, everybody. I hope you had a lot of fun making our earth sun catchers here. It was really exciting to get to do this project with you. I hope you enjoyed it, got to use some fun materials, and got to have a really fun craft to hang in your window. For more Craft Time Fun videos and other library programming, please visit our website at www.grundylibrary.org or check out our social media pages. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to see you for our next craft time. Bye.